Welcome to On The Move. Okay, has everybody had a chance to uh, review the instructions? Yes, sir. Sure. Uh, a lot of the same ones. Mr. Randall, as far as uh, any problems with any of the proposed instructions from defense? I guess we'll go, we should take them in order. Um, my thought is the mere open carrying of a semi-automatic rifle in public is not illegal. I'd ask that to be removed, um, but I don't know, I guess, one I would argue, I think it's if the courts can allow the constitutional instruction, I think that the constitutional instruction essentially incorporates the argument, so I think it, the mere open carrying of a semi-automatic um, yeah. Yeah. to. Uh, Mr. Freeman? Your Honor, and this, what I'm about to say really does apply to uh, the series of four instructions that are non lipids that right. I have. Um, Why don't we just talk about them all together? Yes. Yeah, and although I'm not conceding it's all or nothing, um, <laughs> but I do think that the, the discussion can be had on. The statute says what the statute says. However, the appellate courts have, uh, in certain circumstances, gone to great, great lengths to refine, redefine, clarify, expand, limit the application and the interpretation of this statute. Um, I do think it's important that the jury understands that it is not illegal. Mere, the mere carrying of, of a weapon itself it is not illegal, including a semi-automatic rifle. I think it's, it's this one's kind of similar to on the DUI case where you say it's not illegal to drink and drive. Yeah. You know, it's the same type of, same type of thing. You know, because a lot of people think, oh, you can't drink and drive, and then they come into court and get instruction. Well, actually, it's, it's okay to drink and drive as long as it doesn't, you're not affected by it, and it doesn't this and it doesn't that. So this, I see this as kind of similar to that, just on that. So I, I don't have a problem with the, the language of the, oh, the mere open carrying of semi-auto semi -auto rifle in public is not illegal, so. I'll be in the tank right now, officer. Huh? Let me see your ID. No, thank you. What's that? No, thank you. No, thank you? No, thank you. Okay. Why are you saying no thank you? I, I know it's my Fourth Amendment right. I don't have to show you my identification. Okay, so you're not going to answer. Okay. What's your badge number? 1382. And your name? Devlin. Devlin. Cheers. 1375. Name? Trayer. You do know that you're required by law to actually give me your name when I, I just ask did. By pretty really comfortable too. That's one thing I really like about this bag is the, the comfort level of it. Um, but anyway, so let me move on here and we'll start showing the back here and show the features. Uh, first thing first here, we got the front of it. 